Hare Krishna. Vancha Kaupa Tarugyas Chakri Pazindu Bhari Vachapati Tanapani Yogashana Vidyuna Mahamaha Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Jananda Shri Dwayanta Gadatha Shri Vasali Gopa Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama So yes, it's very nice that we can have another convention. I have the opportunity to be at several of the conventions before. We went to Wankawi Island twice, and we had also Cameron Highlands and some other places. I can't remember all the names, but anyway, this is our first time. As Prabhu said, this is the first time coming to the South which is good for people from Singapore, but it's a lot of difficulty for people coming from the north. So we really appreciate their endeavor to come. I know the devotees were organizing buses coming from Todu and Penang and other places even. Even we have the devotees from Kuchin, came all the way from Kuchin to come and attend this convention and uh, some people also coming from foreign countries like we have the temple president from the Perth Center, Sitaram Lakshman Prabhu is here and Jamani Radha just came from Mayapur. So, so many people are coming because it's very special to have this opportunity to be together with all the devotees. And we have to remember the purpose of us coming together, educate, enrich and empathize. So, very important factors we want to cultivate during this weekend. I certainly hope we'll, I certainly hope I will get more education and enriched and become more empathic also. It's very important for all of us as devotees. We want to increase these qualities. We should never be satisfied to think that we are complete with these things. So Krishna consciousness is a dynamic affair. It's always increasing, right? We want to have more and more of these kind of gatherings. It's important to keep the devotees enriched and educated, bringing them together and having this opportunity to hear from other Vaishnavas. It's, an, it's so wonderful that we put aside everything material, put aside all of our worldly affairs and just come and be here with the devotees and spend the whole weekend engaged in hearing and chanting, engaging fully in devotional service. So that is how we enrich ourselves in Krishna Consciousness, that by taking part in all of these activities. Of course, other things are there. While you're here, you know, the beach is there. People may want to go and bathe in the sea and refresh yourself. And Lord Chaitanya would do that every day when he was staying in Puri. He would take his bath in the sea three times a day. So, don't feel guilty if you're going out to the beach and bathing in the sea. But it's also a part of our devotion to Krishna. You go and bathe in the sea, become refreshed and come back and be invigorated to take part in the kirtan. As we saw tonight, the devotees were alive and chanting and dancing together. It was so wonderful to see all the devotees so happy together chanting and dancing. 
This is our business. This is the world peace. There's a very nice quote which is there. The uh, quote from a letter Srila Prabhupada wrote to one devotee. And he said, whether it's in Texas or China, Prabhupada <laughs> mentioned China. He said, our business is the same. He said, we want to contaminate every place with Krishna. So we have come to this desire to contaminate this place with Krishna.